Okay, guys, here it is. The ward that you guys have been waiting for. I bet everyone's going to be psyched about this. Everyone joined in. I wanted to join in. But first things first. Crush on... Crush on these guys so we can get them out of the war. Crush on these guys so we can get them out of the war. Crush on this. Crush on this. Um, move in right here very, very slowly. Okay, because we're going to have to pay attention to what the Germans do. Because we definitely don't want to engage big, gigantic armies. We definitely don't want to, like, outnumber ourselves. But we need to get the Wartenberg people out of this war as quickly as possible. So that we can just worry about the Germans. We also need to get Krakow out of this war so we can just worry about the Germans. Okay, basically what we just have to do is just worry about the Germans. That's it. I don't care about the rest of the people. I don't care about Krakow. I don't care about them. We just need to worry about the Germans. That's the only people we should be worrying about in this game. Okay. There are... Are you guys sending your men up? I think they are. I'm not entirely sure. But, um... Most likely no one's gonna... Is no one's going to, uh... Mobilize the the mobilizing right into my right into my scheme. Quick off is done. You guys propose peace. There we go. You guys are out of it. All right. We instantly got them out of the war. All right. Now we just need to go get the rest of these. Rest of these, we need to get Wattenberg out of the war. Let's see. Wattenberg, would you guys like out of the war already? No. They want to stay in it. Well, as soon as these guys want to get out of it, then we instantly have a win. Um. We are destroying most of their men without even doing anything. Uh, yeah, we just won 4.0 without even doing anything. We literally just stood there while they just kept mobilizing in our faces. Okay, let's go right here. Go attack their men. Okay. And let's see. They're attacking directly onto my friends. There we go. Go. Go, 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 go. And unlike Germany, I'm going to make sure my men don't die. And make sure that they do actually move in at a pretty rapid rate. Okay, these guys are all sieging up down there. Germany is mostly sending their forces over here to my Netherlands region. That's fine with me. I don't really care about it, so it's fine that they siege it up. I mean, seriously, it's really fine to me if they siege it up. So let's see. Um, some reason I'm losing this battle, so I'm going to go send in more men. I'm really worried about the Germans, because Germans could instantly destroy me. For some reason, they always have the most advanced military. I never understood it, never understood why they do, but they always have the most advanced military. They're always the hardest to kill in this game. So this could be a really hard fight, people. That's that, that's basically why I'm equivalenting it to. This could be a really hard fight, and we might need to do everything we have to try to end this. Okay. Okay. I think I just got Wartenberg out of this. Yeah, they want peace. There we go. Get them out of it. Now, go right here. Go right here and go right there. Okay. 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 We're in the first beginning stages of the war. Um, let's see. Africa wise, I'm probably not going to win many African places. I'm probably going to need, like, the French to come help me out with that. Speaking of which, I should probably come go conquer Ethiopia because that'd be really nice. But I'm hoping somebody will conquer this. No, Sakanto got sphered by America. So I'm probably going to have to use actual CBs to go conquer them too. But mm, right now, uh, the, these guys right here are moving in as quickly as we can. Oh, uh, be right back, people. Hey, sorry about that, people. Uh, didn't expect me to have a nosebleed right in the middle of recording. So, uh, yeah, I had to go fix that. had to basically... I don't know how you guys deal with no please, but I have to deal with them in a different way because um, I've tried everything. I've like tried, you know, you know, plugging up my nose with stuff. I've tried like, you know, putting my two fingers between my like eyeballs and then just like squeezing it really hard to see if it would stop. I've basically tried everything you can think of to try to get rid of a nosebleed. But the best way I found to get rid of a nosebleed, don't judge, is I have to literally stick my head underneath the uh, shower head and basically just dry myself out that has been the best way I found to deal with my nosebleeds and I basically had to do that for like 10 minutes and now I'm back so what were we doing again <laughs> oh yeah we're invading the Germans huh I didn't know that let me go help these guys right here there we go basically an even sized army it's gonna be pretty interesting to see what happens there um yeah we're moving in pretty quickly 
Like, I believe we have a pretty good front right now. Uh, most of our soldiers are coming in to come help us. Our minions are coming in. Our Geostan's coming in to come help. Uh, the only place we can't help is our African colonies because just literally we can't go fight Germany in Africa. It's literally impossible. Also, somebody going to colonize the rest of this part? Because I'm not going to. Why haven't the... Wait. Why didn't the uh, British yet colonize? I mean, they should be major colonizers. They should be wanting to do it. It's like their destiny. But anyways, if we could quickly destroy Germany's like major lifelines, we could end them very quickly. Let's go try to go see if we could go destroy some of these guys. Okay. Let's go see. Can we go destroy this army before we get more German reinforcements? Uh, maybe. We might. It's a very slim possibility. We're also going to probably go have to go send more soldiers to go help that army. Um, and there's apparently more people being sieged right here. That's just Republican Guard. I don't really care about them. As long as they're not nationalists of some sort that could potentially become a free nation, I'm fine with you guys going to go do whatever you need to do. Germany is definitely mobilizing. You can see by how many troops they're making. They're definitely mobilizing as we've seen them do. Okay, we're destroying these guys. Okay, we've destroyed, I think, basically the major majority of the major troops. We just have to go send in these guys. Already have Donchnik sieged. These guys, yeah, these guys are going to need some help. So one of these sieges, whatever ones finish up first. Yes, we defeat them, 24. I think, honestly, we actually might win this one just by sheer, sheer amounts of we won eventually. Uh, wait. So, we're just not gonna even go try that. Let's see, we won some more battles. Uh, let's see, we have some Germans trying to move in. But it seems like generally, overall, we seem to be winning on the main continent. They do have a couple good gigantic armies over there, which I'm really gonna have to pay attention to. And Canada is now a great power. Uh, good job, Canada! Yay, Canadians! Canadian justice, I guess? <laughs> Oh uh, man, that's pretty cool actually, that Canada is now officially a great power. Um, by the way, when does France get to declare war on these guys? Because eventually I do want to call these guys in uh, until 1889. So if we're still at war with Germany by 1889, we're going to call in them. By the way, since this, this war battle is still not over, let's go finish it off. Okay, I want to make sure that we finish off this battle. So we make sure that we go, go right here, go kill these guys. Let's just go seize the rest of this part, and then we'll start dealing with the rest of the other parts. And let's see. Germany isn't really making much advances right now because I basically have... Well, I've destroyed them, essentially, but it's just they don't realize I've destroyed them. So let's go right there, then go right there. Okay? I mean, we basically have already won, but it's going to take us a little bit for them to realize that we've already won. I mean, we're already mostly crushing through all their major troops. They've been in six major wars up until now. They're not going to be able to survive all moving in and everything. So, yeah, they're basically dead. <laughs> I mean, I hate to say it, but they're basically dead. Just going to take us a little bit. Hey, stop doing that. You guys go right there and go siege up that land. Okay? We're not really, we're not really in... Oh, and look, the 18 Armenians are about to arrive and go kill that one troop. Oh, that sounds cool. So we just destroyed that one Germanic Federation guy. We're moving straight into Berlin. Not even stopping. And it seems like we have a couple different armies that are being stupid right now. Okay, I'll have Lombardi just finish out the sieges right there because I don't really need them. Oh no, we just attacked. That's not good. That army might, that army might die now. With them attacking, the army might die. Because when you attack someone, especially now in late game, uh, you could potentially, like, destroy yourselves. Let's move up our soldiers, by the way. Okay, uh, divide the soldiers up into two different divisions. One right there, one go right over there. Keep moving up. Just keep moving up. Four, three, two. That should be able to win. That's still too much of an advantage for them to do much. Let's see, you guys. Yeah, we're going to need the Lombardi. I'm going to need your men. So I'm going to get control of your men for a second. I mean, I don't need all of them, but I just, just need this big gigantic stack right here so we can kill some of these Germans. Or at least overpower them a lot more. Yeah, there we go. There we go. 
That's overpowering. And let's see, the Germans are basically destroying all my land over here. But we have destroyed a lot of their land. In fact, we're moving in pretty quickly. Yes. Yes, we've destroyed most of eastern Germany. We're like almost to Berlin. Almost. And we haven't even really fought. Okay, let's go right here. I'm going to go try to go save those soldiers. Don't give up yet. Yes, there we go. And now that should turn into our battle. And let's see, those guys are retreating too. Go help destroy them. Yes. Yes, destroy that army. Do not let that army retreat. Make sure that army dies. Whatever army it was a part of, make sure it dies. Okay, there we go. You guys move in right there. You guys go crush some of these little tinier armies. Because they are annoying. And then go back to Berlin. Because we're right at the gates of Berlin. Wow, we are at the gates of Berlin. That was insanely quick. I thought it was going to take us a little bit longer than that. But that was just like, Woo, gates of Berlin. We're here. Okay. Probably not going to be able to, like, uh, declare peace yet, though. Because we need to have all of Berlin probably occupied. I mean, all of uh, Africa occupied before we can go and go claim this for our victory. Okay. Yes, we destroyed all those guys. Okay. Uh, Lombardi, you may have your troops back. I just needed them for a second to go destroy those guys. I guess you could sit right there and help us see. That helps us out, out a lot. And let's see. Is everyone basically winning their fronts? Yes, they are. We're right there next to Germany. Go, go, go to Stratton. Uh, fight the disease with everything we got. We will not let any life go unhindered. Even though at this point I really don't need anyone. Let's see, you guys are mobilizing. I don't know why, but I mean, I usually hate when my enemies or when my allies mobilize, but at this point, I really don't care. I actually don't need them to mobilize. And let's see, everyone's moving in pretty swimmingly. Uh, we have a couple good armies now starting to perform with the Germanic Empire, so we're going to go crush through some of these guys because I don't like it when they get this big. When they get to this big of an army, that usually means they're a little bit too powerful. So let's go start crushing through some of these. Yeah, just let's go start crushing through some of these. 47. Oh my goodness. That was overkill. That was severely overkill. Let's see, we got 31 right there. Right there, Berlin. Berlin, baby. We made it all the way to Berlin. We didn't even have to do anything but move in. That is so cool. Okay, and then down here in Africa, how quickly are they moving in? Not very quickly. We have a Jewish stand down there trying to defend myself. Kind of nice of them, kind of not. I wish they were up here helping more with these men, but... Eh, if they want to be down there, I guess I'm completely fine with it, but still. I'd really prefer if they were up here with me, helping me conquest all these lands. Okay. Oh, that's a big battle. Okay. Okay. You guys, move in right there. I think that's a big gigantic army that it's the last big army that Germans have. So let's go send those armies in right there. Go send that army in right there. Send both those armies in. That should be able to counteract that. Go send this army in to go help that army. Okay. Ah, oh, man. Yeah. Once that army wins right there, that army won right there. Oh, where is this moving? Donsu. Okay, go send a good sized force over there to go to Donsu. Okay. So we're going to go crush these guys, make sure that they don't form another big gigantic army. Okay, another crisis has formed. Luckily, it's not involving me. Yay! It's involving Canada and Alaska. Wow. Not exactly places I would picture as crises, but... Okay. Okay, you guys all combine. Okay. No, no. Stay. Don't you dare do anything. Go right over here and go try to go help these 6k men. Because these 6k men are standing up against 51k Germans. Which is a, a vastly amazing feat, may I add. And this is this is so funny because this keeps happening. They can't. I guess they can't flip it over because you can't exactly conquer the entire capital. But, oh my goodness, that's so hilarious. Alright, you guys go right here. You, they have no more. They have no moles. So just destroy the rest of their men. Oh my goodness, and we basically won. We have a couple different men. Let's see, we got more men moving in. Oh gosh, we were destroying more of them, now they're destroying more of us. So there's that army right there that we have to be a little bit weary of. 
Okay. Do we have any more men over here? They're all being made. Okay. So once all those men are made up there, then we can officially use them. But, yeah, we've basically crushed through most of the lines. Oh, uh, okay. Yes. Send more. Send more stuff. There we go. Uh, Germany, Germany, Germany. Man, were you guys defeated. Just shamefully defeated. Uh, I mean, you guys could still bounce back. Don't get me wrong. You guys could still bounce back, but hopefully you guys won't, because that'd be really bad for us. But we lost almost all of the men we had been building up, but you know what? It doesn't really matter, because we won so hardcore. Go destroy these guys. Yes. Boom. Dead. Okay. Now there's a 50, 58, a 38k stack, and there's a... I'm trying to figure this out. So there's a 38. I'm trying to figure out how many more men there are left, these guys. So 38k. Hey, hey, stop, stop running. Stop, stop running. I don't like that. Okay, you guys move up to Lumbeck. Okay, and let's see. Show of War is 92%. Wow, we're almost done with this, and we haven't even... Ooh, ooh, that was a bad decision. Right there. Just like, I think I just ended those guys' careers. Yeah, if we win that battle, I'm going to be really shocked. Let's see, go right there. Go, 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 go send in more men. Thank you. Okay, well, let's, since we only have 92% of the war score, let's go conquer Berlin, and I think we'll have basically everything we need to end the war. Let's go conquer Berlin. Uh, advanced placement. Let's go see this, and... Lazy Names and how that. Whew, okay. Can we do it? 99? Oh my goodness. Okay, we need just a couple more provinces. And then we basically have all we need. Okay, let's go start sieging. Let's go see if we can go siege up that province and finish out the war. Okay. There's a 56 German death stack right there. I don't like that because that means they're probably going to attack somewhere, which I don't like. There we go. Let's see. 98. Oh, that's annoying. We're at 98% people. Wait, how many? Is that just a, a solid stack of 40? Okay, you know what? Venice, hey, dude, give me your command units. You have 43 units right there, and you're not using them. Seriously, that's like a waste, if you ask me. Okay, I'm just going to keep my men right here, because I don't want to move them. I want them, if they engage that other big, gigantic army, the 19k. I'm hoping that they'll fight the 19k. Oh, they're going to fight the 3k. Okay, go, 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 yes, okay, go send these guys in, okay, there we go, alright, and then go send these guys in, oh my goodness, and then they might send in the other death stack, which means we need our minion, okay, no, we need you guys to go in, we need you guys to go in, uh, I'm gonna need to take control of the Arminian army, Arminians, okay, yeah, we're throwing in everything we got into this one battle. Okay, 38. Lazy Nades learn how to adapt. Oh, there we go. 98. Dang it. Okay. And destroy them. Destroy this army. Just make sure it just is destroyed. I don't want any trace of it. Yes, 20, 18. Just everyone dead. Everyone out of here. Yeah. Excelente. Alright, everyone go right here, I guess, now. Boom. Boom. Alright, 8. 133 versus 8,000 dead soldiers. That was not going to end very well for them. Let's see. 95. Oh, my goodness. It's literally right there, people. It's literally right there. Okay. I don't want to attack right there because then that's just going to scatterbrain myself. I'm just going to use all these men to go siege up more land. And we're going to keep all of our troops nearby though. So that just in case if they try anything, we'll be able to do something against them. Okay. And we do have enough soldiers sieging up a lot of good land. Okay, let's see if they want to attack. Yes, they do. Okay, everyone. Actually, you guys go. Go, 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 these men. Okay, 
Let's see, you guys dig the last little spot we needed. Okay, now you guys go. Go! 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 Okay. And now where are you guys moving to? Frankfurt? Frankfurt. Everyone move to Frankfurt. Crush this army. Six, five, four, three, two, one. There we go. And I want to make sure it's all dead, so send all the men over there. Send all the men over there. Send all of our men over there. We want to make sure it all dies. We want to make sure all this army dies so it doesn't come back to haunt us. Boom. Yes. And now they're going to go send in more men over there. Just give it a second. There we go. Move! Move, men! Move! 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 Okay, we got 68. 55. There we go. 30. Just turn the tides. There we go. Alright. 20, 22. There we go. Go destroy the rest of them. Go destroy the rest of them. Okay, we got literally less than 28 Germans left. Okay. Uh, okay. They're still somehow alive, too. So combine all you can combine. But, as you guys can see, we're also moving in pretty rapidly over here. We were so close. We were right there at the border, but for some reason we couldn't close it out. Oh, that's so frustrating. I can't even... Oh, man, we were right there. Right there in the in our clutches. Right there to end this war so quickly. And it's been so dishonorably... Oh... Oh, wait, that's not the capital. Okay. <laughs> I was like, oh, shoot. Okay. Um, Decent-sized army. Let's go to this one, then. Okay. Let's see, can we destroy this army in a decent sized manner? Yes. We're gonna wait until that army moves. Go right here. Go right there. And there we go. Now they have all the 68k moved away. But they're also gonna go crush on these guys over here. Which means we're not gonna be able to save them. But we're gonna go destroy this army right here. So that we can go destroy them in the future. There we go. No, now you guys are gonna all die. Yeah, I'm not gonna let you survive. Sorry, it's not going to. Okay, now we're going to go try to go save that man up there. I'm not sure if we're going to be able to make it. Okay, they're going to all go right here. Okay. We're going to spread out our men. So that we get instant access to wherever they're going to attack. And we also siege up a little bit more of their land. Whew, this is getting kind of exciting, people. This <laughs> is... Okay, we're almost done with all the dramatic lands. We have just a big gigantic plot right there. But the last army is right there. They literally have 36 more troops. The mighty dramatic federation, 36 more troops. That's a good accomplishment right there, if you if I do ask if I do say so myself. Um actually you guys move in right there because I just realized I don't want them to be gauging them right there. And let's see. Hey guys, where are you guys going? If you guys go unseize my land, please go unseize my land. Thank you. Alright. There we go. They're going after that land. Go. Go, 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 go. Go. Okay, and now we're probably going to die for a little bit. Do we have any kind of man building? Right there. Alright. We have a good 72 death stack moving in. Probably not going to be a part of this battle. Uh. Huh? The Ottoman Empire gains uninstall com communism CB. Oh, okay. Well, I want to thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time.